Good afternoon, driver. You are now in charge of this rail tour service to Warrington Central. Along the way, you'll be calling at Manchester Piccadilly, Manchester Oxford Road, Deansgate, Trafford Park, Elmston, Birchwood, and Warrington Central. Good luck. Lower back cramp, Night Vale, I go with the same solution I do for any kind of cramp, and that's just to massage it. Breathe deeply and massage it. You planned a cab ride in a Taurus this summer? Oh, slightly jealous to um tour deck. Slightly jealous. Hey look, it's like my my OWS button. AWS button isn't yellow darkness. AWS button's grey. Speedbird die, I don't install anything that's not from Steam. A lot of the community reskins, well in fact just about any reskin, is unlicensed. So I can't run it. The amount of AI in this is incredible. <laughs> this is a white mead scenario. What can go wrong? Now I'm doubting whether or not I've got lower detail memory on. Why can't I run it? Because um, everyone would con everyone does consider me, whether I like it or not, representative of Dovetail Games. And before you say, but you're not, there are other other people on here that say that just exactly the opposite. And say, yeah, I know, but you you speak for Dovetail Games. As a result of that, I have to abide by the licensing rules. That's why I can't show screenshots anymore. Got told by the licensing team I had to take them off because they were unlicensed. Frame rate is real. It's not really how it works in the real life. Not in Train Sim Guide because. Because everyone knows me. If I was just like a developer in that no one knew I would knew I existed, uh, as in Dovetail, then it'd be different. But I'm quite well known at Dovetail, and in the community for Train Sim, 
and as a result, it kind of it just means I've got to act differently. Can I use licensed third-party content? As long as I can see the license, that's the thing. I, a number of people have. I know I've spoken to people in the past who've said they're licensed, and actually they're not. They've just assumed they're licensed. And if I get it wrong, then I can get fired. That's not that important. <laughs> Can I use like U-Bahn Frankfurt? I don't know. I don't know if that's been a license approved. Well known and infamous, yeah. You got it. See you later, Daniel Sergeant. Oh, I see the U-Bahn Frankfurt. That's a route, isn't it? Yes. Uh, no, I can't do that. It's chair licensed, it certainly is. Who am I? <laughs> I ask myself that every time I look in the morning in the mirror of a morning round later, I'm like, ah, who's that? <laughs> uh, due to a faulty signal ahead, you would need to ask to be allowed past. You're enjoying the camera train, does that? Awesome. Can you get away with companies that don't exist? The companies may no in fact you'd be surprised how many of these companies that don't exist actually do still exist. They're just you know, they're just a piece of paper at this point. Every historic railway and railroad operator still exists in some form or another. Uh, certainly their livery and license and branding do. Oh yeah, Cameron does an awful lot of that stuff, Speedbird. He has all sorts of reskins, and he I've bought him lots of AP stuff. Place a disclaimer in all my streams. No, I still don't want to get fired. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> if I didn't work for Dovetail, would I use that if I had content? I don't know, maybe. I don't know. Request permission approved. Finding out who owned the license for a part of the G2, yeah, really. Of course he's into trains, Speedbird. He goes out to, if you can someone find you Cameron's YouTube channel and um, share a link to it. He's um, up, starting to upload more. He goes out train spotting most weekends and uploads videos and things. Manchester Oxford Road is the next station. I'm kind of ignoring the sound, the timings, to be honest, White Mead. <laughs> I'm not rushing it. 
Of course it's pedals to speed. <laughs> Train outside, direct, there you go. The glorious, the lovely Class 52 Western. Chocolate mini milk for the win. No, you're not allowed to say that, Moggy. Oh. Oh, Cam J. Kerman. That's his name, Speedbird. Cam J. Kerman. He likes. He used to like playing a lot of Kerbal Space Program. So, and they're all like Bob Kerman. So he calls himself Cam J. Kerman. Okay, he won't. <laughs> No, Gouges Route isn't licensed Francois, which is why it's not called the North Yorkshire Moors Railway, it's called Whitby to Pickering or something. at Dean's Gate next. How can I forget what Cameron's gaming? I forgot what I've forgotten. Does it? Hey, no problem at all. <laughs> uh, does Gadget have to release it on Steam? No, it's uh, UK Train Sim is where he's releasing it. Cameron's gaming isn't um, my son. <laughs> no disrespect to Cameron's gaming, but no, that's not my son. My son isn't on Twitch. He said occasionally wants to sit on my stream, but it doesn't happen very often these days. How can I forget Cameron's username? It's more the YouTube link, I can't remember. Trafford Park. Um, I made an exception for that one route, Daniel. Because I know there's no licensing issue with it. And it's awesome. Does this mean Matt is not the father? It definitely means I'm not Cameron's gaming's father, yeah. Somebody else has that offer, honour. The new Doctor will be revealed at the end of the men's final at Wimbledon. Random. <laughs> when is that, Ian? Is it semi is it semi finals this weekend or something? Or is this weekend the finals? When you're on the coaches in the new job and you're over in my end of town. Are you what? You're, you're on longer distance hauling now, are you? Sunday afternoon. The AI in this scenario is ridiculously good. Is that the prize the winner gets? Yeah, the winner gets to be the doctor. I've got fingers crossed that the new doctor is is um, is a lady doctor. It's time, it's time, and they've dropped so many hints about it. I think in the end, at the end of um, one of the episodes, he was talking to 
somebody and he's like oh so in the future we'll all be women then we'll be oh that's a good thing that's, oh come on if that's not foreshadowing the future <laughs> Speedbird, I enjoy streaming. If I didn't enjoy this, then I wouldn't do it. <laughs> Put it simply. Norfolk Southern don't own Conrail. Conrail still exists as a Class 3 railroad. So to use Conrail, you'd have to talk to Conrail. Norfolk Southern took over trackage rights and rolling stock, as did CSX. But yeah, Conrail itself still exists. Actually, isn't quite 50-50. The trackage rights and thing. It was um, so one of them. One of the two companies wanted to take over the, um, the 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 Conrail assets. So the other one went in defensively and ended up getting more of it. <laughs> it was like 55-45. It ended up getting divided up. How do you mean his licensing got a lot more prevalent? What do you mean, Ed? It was NS that came away with more, yeah. Am I looking forward to a new route in TSW? I am enjoying the new route in TSW, yes. You have to, if you want to do a, um, a piece of track, then you really need to talk to the people who own the piece of track, or have the trackage rights on that track. If you want to put a logo on a on a loco on a locomotive or a wagon or something, then you need to talk to whoever owns that um, wagon or that logo. So if you want to do um, sand patch grade, that's a CSX route. But if you want to run a Union Pacific train on it, then you talk to Union Pacific. Uh, and if you want um, a um, Pennsylvania Railroad Company, then you need to talk to American Premier Underwriters, who are the people that own the Pennsylvania Railroad license. Strangely enough. It makes more sense once you know the history of Pencil Pen uh, what happened with the uh, PRR, but... GSW Heavy Hall. <laughs> Go on. How do you explain that, DBAAC? <laughs> See you later, DJSP. Not telling you anything about the new TSW. <laughs> if you want to run a Virgin train on a BNSF route, you do indeed need an audience with the Pope, and the President of the US needs to be in pres in uh, in the room as well, just to find get final sign off.
Smee! New job, start rate taking a 60p, drop to 8 to 50 per hour, then jump onto Natex. Uh, it raises to... Oh, you're on National Express! Oh, wow! Very good. Very good. So you're driving them big things then? Oh, I see. Nat X is where you're heading, is where you want to go to after this one. Pan Ams was a railroad for a long time, um, Fab Diva. I don't know where those particular log wagons are from. I don't have a particular country I'm looking forward to seeing. I'm just looking forward to uh, lots of different things and lots of different trains and different things to do. Who own the rights to own companies? I don't know what you mean, Simon. Was it on the 74 hour stream? I had 66 written on my head. Yeah, it was meant to be 666 because it was the um, Damien, some horror reference. Uh, my wife attempted being funny. Um, but she put 66 on it because that's more train related. So she does, you know, she attempts to, you know, buy into the train geekery at times. <laughs> By the way, Smee, thank you for the donation. Much appreciated. Yeah, it's another month, Dyer uh, Ed. <laughs> Everyone shout at Ed because what the what I've said is that any time Ed mentions about wanting tools, everyone's gonna have to wait another month. <laughs> Daniel, is Sai still doing the arts and crafts thing? Of course she is. It's her life. What do you get if you merge if you if you uh, merge a parrot and a clock? Politics. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> right, Ryan K. Thank you for the cheer. Keep up the good work, Matt. Thank you very much, Ryan. Did I ever get touch time with the wife? Um, to be honest, we've got quite different interests anyway. But yeah, I try, try and make time for it. Steam! Awesome. Birchwood now, seven miles. Who says when I retire there'll be no streaming, Speedbird? <laughs> there'll be more streaming. Darkness, you got a new job for the coming year? Nice. Have you finished uni now?
Let's worry about that when we get to it, Cameron's Gaming, eh? <laughs> Twenty odd years away. <coughs> You're taking a year of semi off time. Oh, okay. You're nearly done then. existed 20 years. <laughs> the same is true for any of us to be honest Kevin, you never know what the future holds. Live for today, not tomorrow. What keyboard have we got, Speedbird? It's a Cooler Master Master Keys Air Pro S. And it's a TKL keyboard, so there's no uh, 10 key on it, because I wanted to save some space. I've got a little USB one that works quite happily, but now, now I've got a lot more room to move the mouse about on the right. You're not getting on a bit, Kevin. God, oh, dear, oh, dear. Sprint now. Yeah, when you don't remember BR Steam anymore, Kevin, that's probably a good time to worry. <laughs> Sprinter, if you're only just starting to get grey hair at 37, you're doing well. This had all vanished long, you know, when I was at university. You retired at 56, don't forget the AWS. GG, well done. You mean I had hair? There is, exactly, not only did I have hair, I had a ridiculous amount of hair, it was just this uncontrollable mop. No, I didn't shave it off, it just fell out. Pictures where it didn't exist. <laughs> Solar powered Jaffa cake munching machine. Father win. <laughs> Rubku! Welcome, Dutch Raiders. Uh, thank you very much. Welcome to the stream, folks. <laughs> Terminator 9500, thank you for the follow. There's Butchwood. 
Speedbird, I own it, yes. I don't run it, I leave that to my dad now, but uh, I do own it. I do some of the te I do the, all the technical maintenance of it in the background. Oh, don't wish your retirement too soon. Enjoy your working career. The trick is to find a job that you love, and that makes it even better. Oh, glad you're enjoying it, Switcher. It's a really good community on there, actually. Some really good people, very helpful. Oh dear. That's really good, white meat. Cameron's Gaming is wanting me to look in Discord. No, that's not the picture with the hair. <laughs> There's a picture I think I posted on my Facebook page from when I was um, Cameron's age. That's some proper hair. Do I love my job? I certainly do. Stir up the cows a bit. Maybe we're about to go over 88 miles an hour, Agseek. Uh, if you look at my scenario tutorials, Luke, uh, in one of those I covered how to add static scenery. Warrington Central, 2.2 .2 miles. I think that's it, I think. Oh no. Then we're going to go over and stable.
You're on your own most of the time, Switcher. <laughs> I do like the 52. It's got such a large visibility, a vis view, visibility out of the uh, cab. Oh, it'll take me ages. It was a long time ago, camera. I have no idea where it is now. Henry Hoover, welcome sir. Did you come in at all for the uh, charity stream when we had the uh, the brand new Black Five on show? Red 5.2. <laughs> One could almost say it's a BR-52. Oh, have you started now, Henry? GG. Class 55. Oh, yeah, uh, Gordon. Is it Gordon Highlander? That's the one in pink, isn't it? No, I haven't uploaded any of the charity stream yet, Oscar. Right, this train is now will not back in use till this evening. Because of this, it will now need to be parked at Warrington Stable Shunt. How was the charity stream? Very good, Henry. Very good. Thoroughly enjoyed it. It's a new format. Instead of doing it as one 24-hour stream, we did it as two 15-hour streams. And, uh, yeah, it was uh, it was much easier to do. I think everyone enjoyed it better. I had a lot of positive feedback from people. Um, and, uh, yeah, it was really good. We raised a lot of money. Um, about 4500 I think. See you later, Oscar. Make sure the points are set to layer into stable shunt. Already done. Maybe. Yeah, maybe, Daniel. Did David Cameron actually visit you at Dovetail? Yes, he did, Francois. He didn't obviously come to visit me personally. <laughs> Is 
See you later, Simon. Oh, sorry, Simon. Yeah, I read that and then completely misunderstood it. Grand job, driver. Passengers have now made it to where they want to be for this afternoon. Time for a well-earned cuppa. Scenario complete. No, well, I'm busy doing multiple things at once, Simon, to be honest. <laughs> right, okay. Who's last? What's last? Leaving Revelstoke. How is Mrs. B? She is doing very good, thank you, Henry. Oh. Oh, now I remember. I was having a problem with this scenario. Let me give it a minute, and if I can't, because I couldn't find it. It's one of these ones where I need to unsubscribe from it, but I can't find it in the list to unsubscribe.